Hey guys, it's me, Bren, Bren Haas, and guess what? I was just up at Costco, and I think people don't know that this is a really good time, especially in Northwest Ohio, to plant your shrubs and landscape for next year. So anyhow, back to Costco. They have my probably second, second, second favorite hydrangea. It's beautiful. In fact, they have it in front of the Costco location if you want to take a look at it. I don't think people realize that they have it in the store for sale right now, and it's cheap. It is the vanilla strawberry hydrangea. I love it, and it's gorgeous. And I want to show you, I've got some major landscape work that I'm working on and a couple of locations here where um, I'm definitely going to use it. I'm going to share that with you, but take your time getting up there because I want to get up there first and get the three shrubs that I want to get first. <laughs> Okay, so here's the tag, and you're definitely going to want to check the tag and make sure it's rated for your hardiness zone. And guess what? When I was checking the tag, I noticed this is grown at a local farm. So this is awesome. It's a win-win for everybody. I'm so embarrassed I'm showing you this. Look what a mess this is. I have not been weeding in there or anything because we had all this construction going on. Look at the hole. So this is all gonna get reworked and I'm gonna bring the bed all the way out. So I'm thinking of putting a couple of those uh, strawberry vanilla, definitely plant in twos or threes. I'm thinking three, because I really wanna put like a really pretty conifer here because my front porch is there and I'll be able to look out and see it. And that's a smoke tree. So here's my smoke tree. It's really bad lighting, but it's very burgundy and it kind of matches the plumes on that on that grass there. Wouldn't that look gorgeous with the blooms on the vanilla strawberry? And behind where I want to put the hydrangeas is a beautiful dogwood. Aren't the seeds on this just beautiful? And man, that will totally, totally complement the blooms on that hydrangea. Okay, so you may have a few questions about hydrangeas. Please ask me on my video here. I'd love to help you out with this. I've been growing them for many years here in Northwest Ohio. Um, oh goodness, at least 13 years. That's a lot. My husband just asked me, hmm, but will they bloom all summer long? Yes, why else would I want to grow them if they're not going to bloom and if they're beautiful? Hello. So the hydrangeas in late May, early June, they start putting on this pretty um, shade, their bloom. It's a really light color. And then as the season goes on and the summer kicks in and then fall comes, they turn into beautiful colors. It's just a beautiful color show out in your landscape all summer long. Can't beat it. Win-win. Now this is not the strawberry vanilla. This is my other favorite, which is the limelight. And I'll share about those in another video. Okay, so I think I might have said strawberry vanilla. It's actually vanilla strawberry. I guess I'm just really hungry for strawberries. <laughs> now I want to let you know that if you cannot find this shrub at your local Costco, definitely check your local garden center and I will also share a link here because they're on Amazon as well and I'd love it if you bought them with my affiliate link. Uh, I want to know I am not a paid sponsor for this. It's just something I love to grow and I want to share it with you. So be sure to comment below, subscribe to my page and get out in the garden guys.